why I came here to be disrespected. Whew, that was close. I thought he was pushing me while I was trying to, you know, cram that thing into my gamma container. So this video is all about luck and just getting lucky. As of late, I've just been having great PvP and just getting a ton of loot. Of course, I've been doing a lot of quests, like a lot. Here's some pictures of my current standings with the traders and their tasks. I've done quite a bit, but I don't want to bore you with 10 minutes of questing footage. Just know, I'm on it. Either way, it's not just players and marked rooms where I'm getting this loot, but I've also been making some really solid investments and spending a lot of money on some stuff that makes me more money. I've also come across some of the bosses. This guy was my first victim. <laughs> Why did I say victim? Like, I'm a predator or something. He normally he's in that corner. Look at this thing. Yeah! I got him? Oh, he had a PP19. Red key card? Question mark? Search faster! Ooh. Oh, I, I missed! Break line of sight, break line of sight. Don't look at them. I don't peek the same angle again. If you just keep changing, they're, they're like retarded. Oh, don't go that way, don't go that way. <laughs> no, they killed that Alton guy with the nade. <laughs> oh shit, he's right here. Oh, like, what? You. I'm gonna shot you in the fucking head. Oh my don't god. Him. Got him. Nice. Sam did say something before this raid, though. Do a scab run, and whatever we come out with, we just roll it right into a PMC. Oh, yeah, I'm down. You see, I was super down. I love the idea of labs, don't get me wrong. It's an amazing place, it's super competitive, it's, it's full of the best players in the game bringing the best loot in the game, and they're risking it because they know the loot on that map. Like, let me just tell you, the loot on that map is crazy. It's, it's the best loot in the game. The raiders are fully geared. Okay, there's Ledex spawns, there's intelligence folder spawns, the whole nine yards. But you see, there's an issue. I don't know that map for the life of me. I don't know where raiders spawn. I don't know what angles to hold. I don't know where the loot is. I don't know where players go. I don't know. You see, Sam does know more about labs than me. So I was willing to try it out with him and kind of just learn some stuff from him and hopefully come out with some fat loot. Oh, what a little bitch. He's oh, he got me. So let's go. Oh, oh, I'm so dead if they need me. Oh, I'm dead. Are you really? Yeah, I got one tap. I got stuck on boxes, bro. I was I was a dead man as soon as they spawned. I want to do that again. I'm not going to lie, Sam. I don't mean to be negative, but I feel like you're about to get one tapped. That is negative. Hold that. I'm pushing with you? Push mark? Oh! You dead? No. I gotta get one tap. Go by leg. Bro, he's gonna nade you. Yeah, if he nades me, I'm just gonna... Oh! I've also really been working on my hideout. The hideout is a really good thing to upgrade, even though it's slow money. They even recently nerfed Bitcoin, which, which sucks, but I'm still in it, baby. I'm still investing. I've also been gambling a lot in the hideout, okay? You see, first Gav case run went like this. Yeah, that right there was like 2 to 2.5 mil profit. Hold up, before you go and just buy a ton of intelligence folders and try and make millions of rubles off scav case runs, just know every single other intel run I've done since has been a loss. I basically am even right about now. It kind of sucks, but because I got so much profit the first time, I feel like I just have to keep chasing it. So there's probably better ways for you to make money. You good? Yeah, I'm good. I thought that was that you. It was. <laughs> Yo, don't mind me. I'm just taking all. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> Bro, I'm sorry, but that was kind of funny. One thing that I learned from last wipe that I've really wanted to implement into my play style and my loot runs this wipe was to play on reserve. You see, reserve is such a great map. There's loot all over the place. There's high tier ammo just scattered everywhere. There is the boss, there's raiders, which spawn amazing loot. It's just really good. And a ton of people who are super geared go on there. You can kind of see that in some of these clips. What the hell is the matter with you? Oh, yup. Oh, that's another one. I, yep, just got him. 
Nice, good shit. Oh, he's so geared though. I'm just gonna quick grab his stuff and dip. Oh, he's got a hex to get in there. Dropped one. That's a raider. Oh! I'm dead. He has a Vulcan. Oh, I got him. Woo! Because I wanted to farm reserve more, I decided I wanted to put a lot of money aside. Like we're talking 4 million rubles. Okay, it's a lot of money. And invest in the Red Rebel Ice Pick. Now what this here item does is it allows you to extract from reserve and woods in the best and easiest and safest extract possible allowing you to do crazy loot runs and get out super safe anytime you want. You don't have to hit doors alarming the entire server what you're planning on doing. You don't have to drop your bag with all the loot in it to extract at manhole. I mean, yeah, you can extract that woods, but that, that really wasn't what I had in mind. That map's kind of trash for loot. Bro, okay, that was the dumbest reaction ever, but you don't realize how, like, this is all I've wanted, okay? Now that I have acquired the Red Rebel, I can safely extract and do productive loot runs on reserve. So I headed into reserve with my good pal, Sam, and we just, we just got some bread, okay? Wait, someone's here. First floor or second? I have no idea. Second. You get him? Yeah. Oh my god! You killed him? Yeah. Sure. Okay, I'm gonna check for one more. What the fuck was he doing? He wasn't paying attention. Probably looking for this guy. Damn. What'd you do? MD- Oh, Val Gamer? SP6. Okay, that dude's clean. I'm super overweight, by the way. Aw, oh, his armor was shit. He had a decent AKM. I'm just gonna strip some of his parts and then you can take it. Dude. How nice and convenient it is to be able to just get right out. Oh shit. Oh. He's on the steps, I think. Yep. Shit. <laughs> he got fucking mowed. He had an M9. His name was Cumfart. Like, that sounds so far. Right in front of me. Oh, there's two of them. Oh, that's a blast. Got him. Player, player! Right in front of me. I need it. He pushed back. Got him. Okay, I say we just loot each of the raiders we killed and just get get out. Okay. And is Bunker Hermanic door open then? No, nope, there's someone down there. I'm hit, I'm hit, I'm hit. I'm falling back though. There's someone underneath the bunker. Let's just top. fall back. Hang on, hang on. Please don't die. Yeah, you got hit from up top, I think. I know there's 100% one inside. If you can go underneath the way we did before, behind this guy, the one where you, you drop the MP7 guy, he's running towards it, you. Right now? Yeah, you hear him? No. Yeah. This is a player's cab. Got him. Now the other guy, I think is on top of the bunker. You can get out there. Okay. Oh wait, never mind. I guess it's not open. Okay, I'm running. You alive? You did not kill him. He's still alive. No, I killed. I, I killed the guy outside. No, that was another one. Woo! Nice.
Das! Да, да, конечно, конечно!